You won't want to miss the Foster Festival's second play this season when artistic director Patricia Vanstone and Norm Foster himself hit the stage in the world premiere of Hilda's Yard. Billy, I'm all set. Yes, I see that. And you're wearing a suit. Well, I want the salesman to know that he's dealing with a certain class of gentlemen here. That Sam Fluck is not just some chowder head off the street that he can take advantage of. The play is about a family. The family consists of mom and dad. And at the start of the play, they think that they are about to be rewarded with their golden years. The children have left home, they have lives of themselves now, for themselves now, and, and the, the, the two of them are looking forward to spending the rest of their time and their money on themselves. Shortly thereafter, their world starts to fall apart as the children re hurt return home, and not only return home, but return home with a big set of problems. So the parents have to deal with that, as well as the father finds out that uh, he's in a bit of trouble at work and he may lose his job, so it's all compounded by that, and it all lands at the feet of the mother, Hilda. That's why it's called Hilda's Yard. Uh, it lands at her feet, and it's up to her to try and solve all these problems. And uh, she sets about doing that in a very amusing way. Now, what's it been like working with Norm? Are we talking Norm the writer or Norm the actor? Well, he's had to change hats. Has he done it successfully? Of course, of course. He's, no one knows how to deliver Norm's lines better than Norm. People know that when they come to see a Norm Foster play, they're going to get a great deal of humor, which he provides in Hilda's yard. But there is something else to Norm, and that is that he's not afraid to step into the places that aren't particularly humorous. Whether it's a relationship that's painful for a son and a father, or a daughter and a father, or a son and a mother, he's not afraid of that. And he'll, will, he'll go there, and he will make people, suddenly, they stop laughing, and they start listening very hard to what's going on in front of them. And then eventually, Norm's smart enough to know that he's going to reintroduce the humor, because that's what people want as well. They want a release when they see something like that. I'm a valued employee of Westcott Paper Products. Mr. Westcott and I are the same age, for God's sakes. And if I want to take a couple of hours off one morning for personal time, nobody's going to ask any questions. It'll be my time to do with as I please. Also excited to be part of Hilda's Yard are returning actor Daniel Briere and newcomer Amaka Ume. It's been really fantastic to see Norm work in the room. Uh, this is my second uh, season working with the Foster Festival, so I'm familiar with Norm's work, uh, but I was most excited to be able to see him actually w physically working with his own text, because I have my uh, internal sense of rhythm when I'm reading uh, Norm's, Norm's words, but I was really uh, intrigued and about the possibility of hearing him actually negotiate that landscape that uh, in this case is a uh, play that he wrote seven years ago. So it's really been interesting to sort of get to see Norm working with his own rhythms uh, and, and, and his sense of humor and comedy is really coming through too. And I see the hand of God because the hand of God is the only logical explanation for you becoming my wife. It's really beautiful to see him excited still, you know, like he knows it inside and out and he's still, um, these characters are still lifted off the page for him like they are for us. Um, and so, yeah, this is a really uh, wonderful, I feel very fortunate to have this introduction. And that first picture flickers into our living room. And after I get washed up, Maybe after I eat because I'll be hungry. After all of that, you and I are going to What are you looking forward to? I bet you're excited. I am. I'm very excited. I, I want, I hope the audience receives this in, in, in the way it was presented to them, you know, with a great deal of heart, a great deal of warmth, and a lot of fun. Uh, twice a day I'll be a walk in the park now, Hilly, with our new television set and no children in the house. I'll feel like a new man. <laughs> Hilda Shard runs from July 10th to July 26. Visit fosterfestival.com for show times and ticket information. At the PAC in St. Catharines, I'm Brenda Schultz reporting for The Source.